have a play. And the beautiful thing is that this cosmic ray, this no cosmic ray, he puts out 10 watts and it's very efficient. Uh, it only uses 10 amps of power. And uh, talking about quality, if you want a quality show, a uh, reliable machine that, uh, yes, it's, it's good to have a backup during shows, but if you want a machine that is reliable, compact, lightweight, because sometimes above eight watts, these machines can get very, very heavy. And you don't want to have something that heavy when you only have two people to set up the entire show because for one way or another, you know, it's like you only have uh, two or four people to set up an entire show in four hours. So I recommend this new Cosmic Ray because it's lightweight. I'm going to be uh, putting the, uh, the specifications on the internet in my page, unitedlaser.net is one of our new products. And uh, I think it's, this is going to be a, a new successful line of uh, laser products, especially for the uh, United States, because many Chinese products before were great. However, some have problems with this or that, not this one. This one has German design, German engineering. However, it's manufactured in China, yes. But the design is German, and it has a German quality to it with the price, affordable price of mass producing it in China. So um, what about graphics? Well, the quality of graphics is very impressive too. You have 4K. You have 4K, very fast scanners. And uh, if we come here, and I'm going to show you a video projection with, with, with lasers to make it even more impressive. I want to show you one of those, like the, uh, like the Star Wars theme here. For example, uh, let me bring it down a moment. Let's go to the setting setup. Let's bring this down a little bit. Okay, so let's adjust this to that uh, raster video that I wanted to show you. I, I just want to show you why this laser not, is not only good uh, for atmospheric, but it's awesome also for uh, projecting images, and especially raster vector scanning, which many projectors cannot handle raster vector, but this one does. Uh, let me show you this. Look at the beautiful, I don't know how good that's coming out on a, Pro, on a GoPro, but here on the studio, it's just looking amazing. I'm gonna lower the power output, because right now we're at 10 watts of power. So I'm gonna lower it to around two or, or four watts, so it doesn't have too much flicker. So it does look amazing. It does look so, so here it is, the new Cosmic Ray 4 from United Laser Technologies, we're in Weston, Florida. <laughs>